Cancer, hi, it's Lisa here from What's Her Name Tarot. I'm here to do your monthly reading for July 2023. These are general readings only, so just take with you what resonates. Check your Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus signs, any number synchronicities that may occur, and cross watches are welcome. Just got home from work, doing these a few after each day of work, so I can still get them uploaded tomorrow, hopefully. But um, here we go. So, July 2023, clear messages from Spirit, please, for Cancer. Overall, you have got the Hermit. It is reversed. Feel like you are wanting to do a bit of soul searching here, some contemplation, but um, you're not seeing light at the end of the tunnel at this stage, I'm going to say. I do clarify everything shortly, try and get some of these reversals upright as well. But at the moment, um, things are looking a bit far off um, for something that you're wanting now and I'm not a patient person so it's like when I want something I want it now but I feel like um, you're doing all this soul searching here and it's like but where is this direction taking me that hermit reversed may have connection to a Virgo here this may be over a job it may be over a home maybe over love something someone somewhere but at the same time this is about getting this kind of energy upright starting to see light at the end of the tunnel when it comes to some sort of situation present energies ten of wands this may have been the whole hold up all through this process feeling like you're having to do everything on your own here um, no support around you this is a burden that is ready to be lifted it is crossed with the queen of wands and that is upright which is talking about confidence determination to go after your dreams and your goals but I feel like once this burden does lift and that chapter has closed off that light at the end of the tunnel may become that full-on spotlight. Strength area, three of swords, it is reversed. I feel like, again, again, you're starting to release this heartbreak that you've had due to interference, meddling, um, where it's not wanted. Too many fingers in the pie, as they say. Somebody has been interfering here, and it has caused a lot of heartbreak. But this is starting to be released focus area queen of pentacles reversed as we mentioned before all the hard work you seem to be putting in you're not seeing the results come your way it's not to say that they're not going to um, happen or, or they're not on their way but this is um, something where possibly you you put the work in here why aren't those results coming through like now Past energies, Ace of Swords, it is upright. Always say this is about clearing the crap out from the past, clearing the clutter out. This is a whole fresh new chapter, a whole new beginning. Clean, honest, open slate. What do they say? Clearing the slate and having that new beginning that is there. Incoming energies, it is upright. The moon may have connection to a Pisces here. When things are a bit darker and grayer, that moon is giving you all the clarity that you need. And this is getting this light at the end of the tunnel. It may just be a very faint glimmer at this stage with that moon there. But it is there. And this is about starting to get this energy moving forward into a direction that you're wanting to head towards. And as I said, have that become that full on spotlight beam what you need to know princess of cups there is an offer of love here whether it's love love whether it's a job you love a home you love could be a younger energy here could be a child could be a pet it may be somebody significant and of course you may be offering that love to someone they may be coming in to offer this love to you but that offer is there somebody by your side how others see you four of pentacles they see you as not being able to release something or someone from the past and this may be the crap we talked about clearing that out from the past there but others are seeing you are still hanging on to something here we will clarify shortly hopes and fears the fall i feel like you're actually starting to um 
have things kick into gear a bit here where you're ready to take a chance take a risk and go for it always say you don't get anywhere if you don't take these leaps of faith along the way sometimes they work out yes sometimes they work out no but this is about digging deep and taking that leap of faith and going for it while your final outcome it is reverse seven of pentacles it is coming back to the hard work that you are putting in and not seeing those results coming out of this but as we mentioned clarifications getting things back up right a bit of glimmer of hope with that moon that's giving you a lot more clarity here and starts to show that light at the end of the tunnel that is actually maybe there is actually maybe that made sense it is there <laughs> okay so cancer let's clarify everything starting with the hermit overall it is reversed four of cups three of pentacles the moon and we just talked about the moon being that little glimmer of light at this stage but i feel like you may be a bit stubborn and focused on one particular cup here there is this partnership involved working together this is about teamwork collaboration and working together to get this journey on board and again that moon is giving you that extra clarity you may have connection to a pisces but um, it is taking a partnership of some sort and again releasing this burden in your present energies with the ten of wands that we clarify now of feeling like you are doing it on your own you get the nine of cups two of cups five of cups a lot of emotional energy could be dealing with another cancer pisces scorpio here but working through some sort of sadness loss grief some sort of emotional setback possibly when it comes to love um, that has occurred but again this may be around this third party energy you are starting to release that energy but at the same time this is about not letting others tell you to hurry up and get on with it this is done in everybody's own way there may be love here by your side that is helping to ease that sadness um, and starting to lift that feeling you're doing it on your own cross with this queen of wands love this eight of cups look at all the cups prince of cups the emperor may have connection to an aries but there's definitely love here confident the two of you do make a good team and work well together but there is some sort of emotional detachment that is needed first and it might be coming back to this four of pentacles energy but um, being able to walk away with your head held high you're in control of the situation divine masculine energy very logical very brave very confident and willing to get things moving and ready to get that happening strength area three of swords reversed you get the seven of pentacles the fool king of cups and here we go with the fool again ready to take this leap of faith here it does take strength to do so you've got the seven of pentacles and the fool that is your two final in up here um, but this is about the hard work that you'd put in to take a leap of faith to take a chance it doesn't come so easily um, as said but you are in control of your emotions as you are able to um, look at this leap of faith and where this may actually take you but it does take a lot of strength and it takes a lot of hard work focus area cancer queen of pentacles reversed you get the magus two of swords three of wands it is a bit of confusion here about what direction to take especially in your focus area this is about seeing the bigger picture taking the blindfold off you are manifesting something or someone or somewhere that is around this um, magus card but this is also about making sure you are very aware of what's going on around you and what's on on offer in front of you taking the blindfold off looking at each direction carefully what works best for you um, these seeing the bigger pictures sometimes they're in a positive way sometimes they may be in a negative way but the main thing is that um, this is possibly that moment to see very clearly what direction you're wanting to be heading in past energies ace of swords cancer 
Ten of Wands, Queen of Cups, Seven of Swords. Some sort of deceptive energy in the past, possibly a lot of gossip and backstabbing. You may have been the target of that, and that's what caused this feeling of um, being left out on your own, carrying the weight of the world on your shoulders, etc. This is about being proud of how far you've come emotionally and walking away from that kind of energy with your head held high. And that is also clearing that crap out in the past. Focusing now on what works for you. Incoming energies, the moon. You get the star, king of pentacles, six of pentacles. Your dreams, they may be starting to come to light and they may be actually starting to, um, to come to life um, as well very, very quickly. Almost overnight, zero to 360 in five seconds, I say. And I feel like this is something that's um, quite unexpected, quite overwhelming, but this is also about maintaining that balance with that um, flood of energy that's coming in with that sudden success here. This is all about that moon giving you that clarity to focus on your dreams, to keep them real, but also to, I'm going to say, cope with the magnitude um, that that success comes in to make these dreams come to life. Love that. Brilliant. Princess of Cups, what you need to know, Cancer. Princess of Pentacles, Ten of Swords, the High Priestess. There is an offer here to um, be on board with you, to work with you, and to end some sort of painful cycle that you have been through. That painful cycle has left you with your guard up here, and this is now about, um, yes, being observant, what's going on around you, but also being observant when this offer is being put forward. Make sure you read the fine print if it's legal contracts, um, but also make sure you're both on the same page around this offer but definitely some sort of offer happening right there love that four of pentacles how others see you eight of wands six of swords queen of pentacles clear honest open communication especially when you're putting some plans into place to get things moving in a forward direction as you do start to see the results of your hard work and that they are starting to pay off proud of your achievements here but coming back to this um, offer making sure we talked about everybody on the same page that communication wise you are wanting to move forward here and release something or someone from this past but this is about making sure that everything is cleared up from that past in order to move forward smoothly hopes and fears the fall the hanged one transition prince of swords feeling like you're maybe sitting on the fence here waiting for someone to make their mind up and this may be around this offer that's being made you're waiting for a decision a solid decision that gets things moving forward here. This is about not rushing into things. Make sure that this, we just talked about, the closing of the past, of the past chapter, making sure that that is all taken care of, legally and morally, I always say, in order to um, turn that page, turn that to the next chapter, even the next book, as I sometimes say, and focus on what lies ahead. A decision that is needing to be made around that. Could have connection to Scorpio. And your final outcome, Cancer, Seven of Pentacles reversed. Seven of Wands, love it. Four of Pentacles, Princess of Cups. Whatever it is that you do feel like you're stuck and hanging on to, it may be a legal contract that you are trying to extract yourself from in order to take up this one that's on offer right here. This is about, again, legally and morally, but there is this offer of love. Could be a job of love job you love of love could it be a job you love could be a home you love could be love love but this offer is here there's persistence there's not giving up there's not quitting no matter how much hard work is needed here to release yourself of that energy you are sticking to your guns and determined to do so wow okay so cancer let's see what the universe says to finish Princess of Wands reverse, Ten of Pentacles reverse, but look at that, Six of Wands upright. It may be a case of sharing too much information up front, 
to begin with and this is about maybe holding some information back until things do start to get sorted because that princess of wands and the ten of pentacles reversed it's talking about the information you're giving the sharing of ideas you're giving it's putting a halt to the success coming your way but once some I'm going to say discretion is put into place here that victory is yours and it is yours to take with both hands and run with it so yeah cancer that's what i have for the month do hope it helped thanks for watching and i will see you all next time for the week please see ya bye